Hopewell friends, it's Mrs. Ruth. I'm here with my very special friend, The Very Hungry Caterpillar. We're here to read you his special book. The Very Hungry Caterpillar was written by Eric Carle and it was published by Fillmore Books. I hope you enjoy. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. On Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and plop, out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums. Nom, 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 nom. But he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through four red strawberries. But he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges but he was still hungry. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one green pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one piece of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry cake, one piece of salami, one cupcake, and one piece of watermelon. And that night, he had a stomach ache. The next day was Sunday again, and the caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. Nom, 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 nom. And after, he felt much better. Now, he wasn't a hungry anymore, and he wasn't a little tiny caterpillar anymore. Now he was a great big caterpillar. So he built a small house called a cocoon around himself. And he stayed inside for more than two long weeks. Then he nibbled a hole inside and he pushed through his cocoon and out came a beautiful butterfly. I hope you had a good night, friends. Thanks for enjoying the story with me. Bye.